It was a cold evening night where the port was silent. Ships were unloading and going and Saltine and Gilbert were having some chat. So you see, it's why I take a lot of freight trains outside while you are always stuck in the port. Now don't get me started right here, mate. See, just because I'm a hard worker in the port like you lazy engines, doesn't mean that I have to do everything around here. Well, you are the shunter. I will shut it. Then, an hour later, they went to sleep. Always silent. Always calm. And then the workman came up to them. Asking some... Something. Excuse me. Hello? Yeah, excuse me. Saltine. Oh. What time is it? Yes, um... I need to shut this coach loose over here. Isn't it quite early? If you don't do it, Gilbert will do it then. <sighs> Fine. The workman helped her start, and off they go. Shh! Don't start your whistle. Don't want Gilbert to be alarmed. Yes, sir. She said in a quiet voice. Suddenly, Saltine felt very tired again. She fell asleep while the workman started. Saltine came to a sudden stop very quietly. The workman got out and said good night. Then he went back to his good house. Always peaceful, always quiet. This was very short, but we did have a good time. Why do I pull off guys light on? Game Tez. What the hell? What the heck are you doing awake? Very sorry workman. I'm trying to get some sleep away from those annoying coal bunkers. It doesn't mean you have to stay in the shed away from Gary, Old Iron and whatever that other name is. Is it because Paul is keeping his light on because you were over there having a good nap? Don't muck me sir, please. Could you please, could you please move me onto the other siding? All right. If I can actually get on you. Well, that was a good day. Goodbye.